What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So in this video, what we're going to do is we're actually going to compare my newest addition to a very popular original flanker of a fragrance that already exists. So this one is going to be from the brand of the Zassi. This one is Rosasi Habas Ice. So I just got this fragrance into the collection this past weekend. I've got a tester of it. Now we're gonna do our smell test and we're gonna see if we're gonna compare is this one better than the original Havas. So Rasasi Havas Ice, here's the bottle right here. I like this bottle design first and foremost. Um, just comparing it to the original Havas, this Havas Ice is going to come with us with some anise, gonna come with us with some cardamom and some amber. So a little bit different fruit notes in the, in the opening. You're gonna have some cardamom, so a little bit of a spice in the mid, and then you're gonna have that amber woods in the base as opposed to the original Havas. The original Havas was gonna have some cinnamon, some watery notes. It is gonna have cardamom, but orange blossom as well. And then it had more of that amber and musk, the amber grease and musk in the middle, I mean, in the base. So in the base of Havas, the original, you're gonna get a much more dry woods and musk, and a little bit of watery notes and cinnamon as opposed to with the ice, you're gonna get some anise, you're also gonna get some cardamom, and then you're gonna get some amber wood as well. So we're gonna check and see how these two fragrances compare. So if we hold them up side by side, you got the ice and you got the original Havas, both fragrances. I mean, this one I just got, but this Havas definitely I've used up some. Let's see here. All right, so on the first test strip, we're gonna go our original Havas. I'm gonna let this dry down some. Nice siage in the air though. And then in this fragrance, we're gonna go with the ice. While these two are drying down, I'm going to skin too. All right. Been a while since I wore the Havas. Let's see here. I still like Havas. I still like Havas. I'll tell you this though. Havas Ice though, I think. I think, oof. They might have, they might have, they might, they might have a winner. Uh -oh. So this is the thing. I think with Havas Ice, if you're someone who, when you had Rosace Havas, you've gotten your nose on it and you feel like Rosace Havas is a little too tart, a little too fruity, almost a little too much on the spices, you know, because of the, because of the cinnamon, because of the watery notes, you know, it maybe smells too much like shower gel and you want something a little bit smoother, a little bit more watery, a little bit more sort of aquatic, right? And then I think you would like Havas Ice. I think that star anise mixed with that amber gives it a little bit level of like smoothness, a little bit more calm. And then it's a little bit spicy, like almost like you, know, you, you have a level of like, they wanted to tone this down to a degree. Now, again, if you like Hawaii, so I don't think you can go wrong with it, just for the price. But I think if you want something that's a little bit more even, a little bit more smooth, you're gonna like Havas Ice. But both fragrances I like too. Both I would say get, have them both in your collection and you can use them for different settings. Like for me, I'll use Havas, the original for a day that is particularly more sunny. And then I would use Havas Ice for a day that's a little bit cooler outside. So in terms of can you justify having both in your collection, for me, you can, right? I would have this one. This one would be for a particularly sunny day, for a particularly hot day outside. And then I would use Havas Ice for a day where the sun is out, but maybe it's a little bit cooler, whether you're thinking maybe 60 to 70s, this one is 80 and above. You know, that's how I kind of differentiate them or vice versa, depending on how your style goes. But nonetheless, just talking about Havas Ice, this is definitely a dub. I like this. It's a nice, crisp, clean scent. Kind of smells like fresh out the shower with a level of fresh laundry too. It's like both of the fresh and clean accords coming together, right? Um, I like it. Nice sillage. And it still performs. It's a little bit more subtle, so it's not going to be as further projecting, but I do like the sillage. I do like the notes in there and this is definitely one i'm glad i got my hands on okay but again guys get your hands on rosace Havas. if you don't already have one whether it's the Havas original or the Havas ice get your nose on them and see if you'll add them to your collection we'll catch you on the next one much love